70 foot. Look short through the camera, but my rope on there. The ground's still a little soft, so I'm gonna go up here, hook on the truck, do a stay in the driveway because I got four drive on it. I have to extend my rope a little bit. The sucker pulled down this way. Long enough to want to have to add another rope. Oh man, maybe I can make it work. Pull it, got it tied, so I'm all the way down there. Back of the truck, <laughs> and I already got a decent cut in that tree I done a couple days ago. So I'm gonna give it a little bit of tug, especially since it's a locust, really skinny, it should fall pretty easy. I'll give it a little bit of a tug with my truck. I might be lucky and have a fall with the pole. If not, I'll have to go cut it a little bit more. We'll see what we can do. All right. Nope, didn't get my rope tied on good enough, dang it. Take two, Let's see if we, if I got it on there better. Still don't know if it's gonna be, my cut's big enough. Throw it on my window maybe. Let's see. We get it to go the way we want, just a little bit of pull should. that limb now we're on the big part of the tree still pulling some cracking now nope ain't cut enough I'm gonna have to go make my cut a little bit bigger too tight of a pull I don't want the tree to end up flopping backwards or something stupid Go cut some more. Came just like that. Hopefully I got that on the video there. Back her on up. Get some tension off. That's it. Came just like that. This tactic, I guess. Uh, just got one more left standing there, two down now. <clears throat> Did one the other day, but I'm cutting it high above the fence that way. Hopefully, if it keeps working like this, I can get it to fall above the fence. See, like that. And that one was kind of split, but now I can go back there and you know, I can kind of piece this down. Um, it's gonna be a little more difficult since this tree right here is a double tree. I got this one. This one's a little bit more scarier. I'm probably gonna have to have someone come help me with this one. It's gonna take two people, one in the truck ready to go and one cutting because the dog kennel back there and that's kind of leaning all different types of ways. I think it'll be alright because it's pretty light. You know, my truck can pull that without any problem, but this one, I'm not really sure how long that was. I just guessed earlier and said, I don't remember what I said. I know my internet tower is 80 foot and this tree was 15, 20 foot shorter or so snap off up there quite a bit too but over there over here big old branch fell off the top it's pretty little on the top but that's how big it was about for me down there so yeah get somewhere here these these trees are dangerous anyway pretty much dead and stuff and they just fall over so easy I hardly had to pull it just cutting halfway through that one right there is going to be the pain in the butt. Split off all over. I'm going to have to do each one one at a time. I have a truck way over there and a long rope. The one leaning in over the kennel is going to be pretty complex. I'm not sure how that one's going to be. 